guys, so I thought for today's video I would do something kind of fun. I am actually going to be using all my absolute favorite products um, and making a look with that. Um, so let's get started right onto, into this video and see exactly what we can create. So the very first product I'm going to be using is the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. This is one of my new favorite primers ever. And I'm just going to be putting this on my cheeks and my T-zone area. Then as you can see, I am blending in using my fingertips. And I am blending in using circular motions to really make sure that it's into my skin. Doing a little dance because I was listening to music. Just having a little fun. And then for foundation, I'm going to be using the Bequa Aqua, Aqua Luminous Perfecting Foundation, and I am in the shade Light. And I'm just using a beauty blender to work this in. I find that a beauty blender helps make it blend out so much more naturally. Making sure to blend it down onto my neck so that it looks more natural and there isn't a harsh line. And here I'm just adding a little more on so I get a little more full coverage. And foundation is one of the longest processes for me.
So next I'm using the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Translucent Powder and I'm just using this big large powder brush that I got at CVS and this is just setting everything in and making it a nice soft canvas for the powder products. The next thing I'm using is the NARS Laguna bronzer and this is a new addition to me and I really do like it a lot. And I'm just going to be using the e.l.f. contouring brush to apply this bronzer. And I'm going to apply it to my cheekbones and to the top of my forehead to give a nice sun-kissed glow. And then I'm just getting a little bit more product on the brush, not too much. And I'm just going to blend it onto my forehead. And now I'm going to be using the LA Girl blush in just blushing. And the shade I'm using is called Just Playful. And I'm not 100% sure what to call the brush that I'm using, but I'm making sure it's blended out nicely. And now I'm just going back in with the powder and I'm using this angled blending of Beauty Blender to bake my cheekbones. And now I'm going to be using the Essence I Love Stage Eyeshadow Base. And I'm going to apply this all over my eyelid and blend it out using my 
ring finger. To set the eyeshadow primer, I'm going to use the Makeup Geek eyeshadow in the color So Pale. And I'm using the Morphe M173 brush to blend it all out. And then the next color I'm using is the shade Creme Brulee and I'm going to apply this in the crease using the brush, the Morphe brush M441 and I'm going to blend this all over my inner crease and make sure to get a little bit of it on my brow bone as well. And this is just a beautiful transition shade and I love how beautifully it blends and you can build up the color. And as you can see here, I'm just doing windshield wiper motions back and forth, making sure it's nice and blended. next eyeshadow color I'm using is the shadow from Makeup Geek and it's in the shade Cherry Cola. And this is a beautiful red brown and I'm going to go on the outer corners of my eye. And I'm just using an Anastasia Beverly Hills brush. To apply it to the outer corners of my eye and then to blend it out I am using an angled um, shadow brush as you can see I'm just blending it out
I'm using the NYX Glitter Primer and I'm applying this with a flat shadow brush to the inner corners of my eye. And this is just going to help make my shimmers, my glitters, my um, metallic um, eyeshadow colors look more dramatic. And now I'm going to be using the ColourPop eyeshadow in the shade Birthday Wish and this is a super shock shadow. And I'm just applying this using the same flat brush I used for the eye primer. So as you can see here, I'm just really making sure that it's blended out. And then I'm just using the same angled shadow brush to blend out the edges. So it blends more naturally. And then I'm going to get that powder brush I was using and just blend out the bake. And then the eyeliner I'm using is the Essence Super Last Eyeliner in Deep Black with 18 hour wear. Gotta say, I'm pretty surprised I put the eyeliner on this well, because usually I don't do it on camera, because I mess it up. Then I'm using the Eyler London collaboration with Jordan Woods eyelashes and the lashes I used were Tropic Like It's Hot Faux Mink Lashes. Then here you can see I'm applying my highlighter and talk about giving a bling. And I'm using the highlighter by Makeup Revolution and I'm using the shade Just My Type.
and I'm using the Morphe R3636 brush to apply the highlighter. And for lips, I am using the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Liquid Lipstick the in the shade Non Caramel. I absolutely love the way this applies and how it feels. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and the makeup look I created. This is something I kind of go for every single day. These are my favorite products that I use all the time. And um, I hope you enjoyed this look and I hope you enjoyed this video. How many times am I going to say that? But thank you for watching. Give this video a like. Uh, subscribe on the button down below and I will see you guys later for another video. Bye.